Brand new tonight, turned away from the Sunshine State. Some Alabama residents who went to get COVID vaccines in Florida are now being denied the second shot. Vaccine availability is the issue. In Alabama, the state health department says it's not taking that stance. NBC 15's James Gordon has been looking into the issue. James, Alabama will continue to take care of anybody who needs a second dose. That's right. State health officials say they've been getting phone calls from Alabamians across the state line to get the vaccine, and they want to reassure those folks that everything will be okay. I am lucky. 82-year-old Gary Bird and his wife drove from Loxley to Milton, Florida in early January to get the Moderna vaccine. We wanted to get it as soon as we could. We didn't want to take any chances. He and his wife are lucky indeed. They also got their second dose this week in Florida before some clinics in that state started to turn out-of-state patients away. Alabama health officials say all are welcome here. In Alabama, we've not restricted um, uh, vaccination uh, on the basis of residency. I know there are uh, maybe at least uh, two states that have done that. Florida's done that. Maybe one other one has done that. In Alabama, all you need is to show your vaccine record card to get the second dose, regardless of where you may have been given the first dose. Now, one catch, however, right now in Alabama, the health department says they will only be offering the Moderna vaccine as a second dose, but that, of course, could change based on vaccine availability. But now we're live in Baldwin County. James Gordon, NBC 15 News. James, thank you. The good news, Dr. Harris says additional vaccines are on the way. Walmart and Sam's Club stores are set to start giving out doses in Alabama. That could start in the next 10 days. The company has been given 14 to 16,000 doses for the state. Dr. Harris also says these vaccinations are not get out of jail free cards. Today, he urged people not to return to normal gatherings, especially during the big game this weekend.